All right, hey, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I wanted to throw this uh, little bit of introductory piece in here in front of some of my gameplay footage from the arena um, because I don't, I don't, not very good at doing this in terms of like laying out the characters and their levels and stuff like that because I just think it's not very. It's, I think it's pretty boring, but like leveling characters up and gearing them up, everyone knows what that kind of looks like. But here you go. So for the footage, you're gonna see Kang is level 90. All his abilities are maxed. He's at tier uh, G16. He's at Raider, but don't all you uh, ISO Nazis out there, don't worry. I have him as both. Um, I, I did Striker yesterday on my first look video, and I'm just messing around with Raider to see how that plays out. So um, there you go. That's going to be it. Uh, that's going to be for the rest of the video. So there you go. All right. Hey, welcome back to the channel. I uh, decided to do a little bit more arena gameplay footage. Um, I have, just uh, just so you know, I have moved my defense to this. Eh, it's kind of mixed result. Basically, the idea is like you got this trio, so they have to match it. Um, they can't come in with Hela because obviously Archangel's there. And so they need to do something to counter that speed element. Um, and, it, and, and some people have. I, I've been holding steady here, like I said. Um, there have been some people that knock me back. I think I was, it's probably Azrael. Um, we'll, we'll see what happens here. Let's go take care of this. So the doom here is a little bit concerning because you don't want to, you, you have to try and finesse this so you don't trigger his, uh, his ability. Um, I've faced this before. I've, it's, it's easily winnable, but it's, it's not as, you have to finesse it. Because you can trigger it fairly easily, so you have to be careful. Um, I'm not going to do this because you can actually damage him and trigger it, so <laughs> um, not a good idea. Let's see here. Um, you know, I, I don't actually like this ability. This, this ability, I don't really think has a lot of value, to be honest with you. Um, I do like that basic, but... Uh, Okay, that misses, great. Uh, so let's do this. Great. Now, once Spider Weaver goes, this should be game over. So she's gonna go down the line. See, now this is where you can screw this up because I don't want to blow everyone up. He's controlled. She's gonna die on the next move here. So just, just eat it, right? Just eat this. Just do a basic or something, you'll be fine. Great, and then, well, if he had his damn, um, well, let's just do this. Boom, there you go, Billy Black Cam, so he can't do that. Oh, she ended up going, well, it doesn't matter, because she. this is unavoidable. So he's dead, don't have to worry about him, she's dead, they're all dead. Well, oh, is this, <laughs> Emma Frost survived. So here's Kang, boom, just, just swats him away, <laughs> I love it. And then here we go. That's cool. That's that, I really I, I didn't know Kang uh, relied so much on weapons, I guess, or like a, a handheld weapon, I should say. Boom! Look at that, man. He's one of my. I don't know why I'm uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of villain characters. I don't know. I don't know what that says about me. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. All right, so uh, let's. Uh, so Azrael has knocked me back. Azrael, if you're watching, that other defense is actually more impressive. To be honest with you, there's more uh, tight, <laughs> tight rope walking I have to do. This is just, it's fairly standard. You can beat it even without. I mean, we've people have been beating that without Kang forever. So I mean, again, arena is arena. Everything beats everything. So I don't think Kang makes that big of a difference than what you were already seeing. Maybe when he's a lot higher in levels, maybe he poses more of a threat on defense. I don't know. But um, again, I think he's still an amazing character. Um, and just to clarify a little bit on my uh, on comment on his special, I mean, I think it has value. I just, that that speed up on his basic is just so tempting. Oh, I'm just a freaking speed nut, I guess. I don't, and I know he gets offense up for to be able to use the, um, Whenever he gets to his ultimate, but I don't know. I just really like that, and it does a lot of damage. Um, just really like the whatever. <laughs> we'll use it. 
So we killed Weaver, and then we're going to ability to block Rogue, and he's gonna miss. Yeah, this is this fight is easy as hell. Like this isn't even a, and so yeah, I mean, Weaver should be dead. Oh, she didn't die. Oh my goodness. Come on now. I should have focused on her. Well, it wouldn't have mattered. Um, because uh, she just would have... Well, yeah, she died, right? So it, the stun wouldn't have mattered anyway. And this is unblockable. So it doesn't matter. He has often sup, which makes sense. Um, so that's from the special. Look at that. Awesome. I'm trying to think what would have happened. Who would I normally bring in here? I think I normally would have brought in... Hella, and Hella would have done her ult. So I mean, I, I mean, does he change the? Does Kang change the arena dynamics? I mean, I don't know. I think it just makes it easier for people that don't have some of these characters. I don't know. But uh, there you go. Uh, we'll do a couple more of these, or maybe one more of these. I think people get the idea. Um, he's really good. Um, but let's see. All right, we're gonna do one more. Um, let's see here. Not hitting my buddies here, my colluders, my fellow colluders. Um, so we'll hit Rocky, Rocco, and this is a good, this is a good team to uh, fight. Uh, let's see, yeah, speed versus speed. So he came in with, uh, this is in anticipating Hella. Um, yeah, let's go. It's it's a good defense. I, I do like that defense, but uh, obviously I had it up for a while and I got blasted back to 42 just because I wasn't active. So maybe not as good anymore. Um, people is obviously anything is uh, gets figured out. And it's interesting how this is going to play out. To be honest with you, I think um, when the horsemen come out, people are going to try. Hey, how can we? He can be revived. Wow, what just happened there? The, the ISO attack doesn't kill him? Did I just one-shot Weaver and then erase the thing? Wow. <laughs> Come on, man. <sighs> Whatever. I guess it is what it is. I mean, what do I have to do about that? Um, let's do this. I'm not too concerned about his Archangel's ultimate. Ah, oh, he resisted it. All right, so what's gonna happen here? I'm gonna do this, bop. There we, there, um, there. Emma Frost is gonna do whatever she's gonna do, her special. The slow is still on Dormammu, and then I'm still gonna get. I'm gonna blow up Weaver here. Okay. And then, unfortunately, well, it's not a big deal. Let me let me ability block him so he doesn't do his. And then we're going to hmm, go down the line here. See, I haven't even really used Kang. So so here's my kind of thought process on what how this is going to play out. Um, is a, He's really good. See that there? Really good. Does he change the arena that much? Not. I don't think so. Not yet. I mean, it's another tool in the tool belt, right? I mean, everything again, everything was beating everything, so what's different? Now you just have a different way to beat everything else. When Apocalypse comes out, I think people are going to start using the Horseman and Apocalypse. And then probably some speed combination starts beating that. Probably with Kang. Because typically what happens when you have a good team, people just mirror it. And they get tired of the coin flip, so then they just drop the least important one, and then they put a speed character in there. And Kang would be it. Kang, at even at 5%, is going to tip the scale. And then I think eventually it's just going to devolve into a speed <laughs> a speed competition and seeing how many people you can get rid of. And that's why a lot of the horsemen's passive say, you know, three horsemen or apocalypse ally, right? So I think they've already factored into this. But anyways, I think that's it for me. Um... I think we've seen enough of Kang. He's an amazing character, really good. But as of right now, I don't necessarily think that the, the arena changes that much. You're, you can still use the same characters you were using before to win. Uh, 
I think his impact may become better revealed once the Apocalypse comes out. And then I think you're going to see a lot of good theory crafting. Um, but yeah, I'll, uh, just keep an eye out for my Cosmic Crucible video. I'm going to be testing four-fifths of the Masters of Evil whenever uh, the next round of Crucible comes out. We'll see how he performs there. I have really high hopes for that one. Um, and I'll do also do some uh, war testing whenever the full I get the full Masters of Evil team. So uh, please like and subscribe if you want to see all that. And I uh, will see you on the next one.